Welcome back to Academy TV. It's been a while. It's Stone Mr. Marshall versus Holt. It's the Dorset League Cup, I believe. Or the Air Ambulance. I think it's the League Cup. There's the squad for Holt. This is about a month ago. Just been well busy with work, live stuff coming up. Thanks for Holt being patient with me. We're going to catch up on the videos and get back to some sort of normality. Um, other reasons why I left this video out. It's not the best game to show. Obviously, Sturmitz to Marshall in a position of transition at the moment. Surprising. First team was in the cup final last year. Reserves was in the cup final. So, I'm not sure quite what's happened. There's obviously been changes. Some good, some bad. Plenty of signboards up. Never actually had footage from Sturmitz to Marshall before. Never been there myself. Pitch looks good. Signboards all around everywhere. Like the look of that. Um, let's get on with the football. Sturmitz to Marshall obviously in the turquoise. Holt in the red and black. Oh, he's done him there. His air got in the way then. Could he get a, a band? A Nike band? Academy TV band, maybe. Hmm. Merchandise. Holt coming forward down the right hand side. Beating his man. Oh, he's battling away with him. He's put into the box. Scott Bungai. Whose man was that? He's poked into the back of there. Sponsored by. Eye catcher, Pom Pom London, and Jack Williams Fitness. Let's have a look at the replay. Brilliant finish there by Scott Bungai. That's what he does. And he's 17 as well. He's such a good player. How many Dorset Premier League goals he scored last season? But it was a lot. Step some Marshall on the ball anyway. One 0 to Holt at this point. Shapes a little bit out of Step some Marshall from what I can observe so far. Still kind of running back to the goal, inviting Holt on Gerard. Blocked. Backs against the wall for Marshall. They need to break there. Nothing confident. Hang on a minute. We've got a two-hand signal. He's played it to him. I reckon he's played rugby before that fella. He's just absolutely clattered him. Check this out. Definitely a penalty. No arguing there. Probably a booking. Number seven can't believe it. <laughs> penalty. Ali steps up. Back of the net, 2-0, 22 minutes in, not the best start for Sturmitz to Marshall. Mind you, Hull are reigning DPL champions. Don't get enough credit for their amazing comeback last season. October, they were a load of points behind, they had a few games in hand. They went on like a 22-23 win streak or something, or unbeaten. Come from behind a ridiculous amount of times in that, so they were a good side. Sturmitz to Marshall, get that played over. He's absolutely sent that. Don't foul him. Don't foul him. Best advice I've had all morning. Good amount of spectators here as well. They've obviously got a good following. I should imagine a few of you uh, hope they travel quite well with fans, ultras. And then headed away, he's brought it down. It's that man again, it's Ali. Keeper saw it late. I think it might have gone in off the post. 26 minutes. Stomach to Marshall, nil. Holt free. Love it. Hat tricks on. Only. No pressure there. You know, you've got all the good advice, but when things ain't going your way and there's too many changes, it just ain't going to happen. 3 0. I don't know where that guy's playing, but he is well out of position. It's absolutely clattered him there again. Good advantage, good save from the keeper. Clamity, good save from the keeper again. He picked the 
halfway back up, it's a drop ball. Holt coming down the right hand side. He's threaded it through. Scott Bungo, someone's got to get tighter on him. He's threaded him through. Here's the hat trick. It's Ali Gerard, 44 minutes. Stermans to Marshall, need to. Shop, really. Can't be long till the half. If they can take 4 0 in, it's something, I guess. I don't know. It's scraping the barrel. They're all over the show. I can only say what I see. And it ain't looking good. That's why I left it as long as I could, really, because uh, it's the last thing I needed. It's blasted over. Win, laws, win, lose, or draw, we show the games. I know some teams don't like it. I won't mention their names, but it's football. It's what we do. Hopefully, they can turn around from this bad patch, this transition season, get back to some cup finals again. I said I won senior league the year before that. Uh, Limited loyalty at grassroots football, that's one thing that I've noticed. You've got a good team one year and the next year they've all gone somewhere else. For an extra pint or a pie behind a bar afterwards. You're not yourself when you're hungry. A bit hazy on that side, I'm not sure whether the camera needed a wipe or it's the sunlight coming over, but we've stuck with it. Could be the sunlight really, it's just behind the scoreboard. Did the ref need to add any on? Well, it's in the back of the net. Sonny Wilkinson, sponsored by Wilkinson's Projects. Interesting. I'll leave a link in the description. Here's the replay. Took a bit of a lucky deflection there. Five now. Not looking good. It's going to be a long afternoon. Go on, ref. Blow for half time. Cut back. Nice. Hold coming forward. Where's the whistle referee? Come on, man. Nice touch in the back, and I believe that was Manners 48. Diffie and Trait couldn't see the squad numbers with the haze, but hopefully, I got that in the right order. Him and Sonny were the only ones that scored the uh, single goals, everyone else got multiple, so hopefully, that's right. Sam Bennett as well later on in the game. Spoiler alert 6 0. The ultras are still sparing them on. Got to credit that. Uh, referee, where is this whistle, man? We're approaching 50 minutes. It's 6 0. Blow the whistle. Just power mad. Power mad, these referees. Over 50 minutes now on the clock. It's just not necessary with the scoreline, is it? There you go. Half time at Churchill Close Recreation Ground. Never been. Like the look of it. Rest of all the signboards. Press for the ultras behind despite the scoreline. Thanks for watching Academy TV so far. Don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button. Leave a comment if you can. 95% of people aren't subscribed to my channel or viewers. Nearly 6 million views now. Over 4,000 subscribers. 7,000 likes or something like that. Living the dream. Daily posting. We've got some sort of system back on board now. We're back underway. Patrick Hero, the first half. Ali Gerard. Not looking good for Stone. It's the Marshall. They've got to park the bus, really. Just like that one over there. Got to park that minibus. Such as Marshall saw on the website, signboards, 250 plus that. Got a few room for a few more over there. Another club similar to struggling to even get a squad out in New Milton this year. They got to the playoffs last year. You know, across the leagues and up and down the country, there'll be teams that are struggling. You know, any play, who turns up? It's another goal. Ali Gerard, 49 minutes. Take him off. Come on. <laughs> He's on a rampage. 
Thing is, cup game, goal difference doesn't even matter. It's another good goal there. Could say to people ain't picking up the key, player, key players. By now, seven 0 down, you should be able to identify who the, the risky players are. You've got a man mark I and mean, shut up shop. Really, look for a bit of a consolation on the counter attack. Play for a bit of pride in the second half. Big out of there. So this is straight from kickoff. They've just conceded. Help coming forward again. Keeper's got that. Run as much of the clock going as you can, fella. Good idea. Is that the keeper that took a big clatter in in the final? I put him more town at New Cuthbury. I think it is. It's against Sturmins and Newton. Good final, actually. I enjoyed myself. Gerard. Oh, he's put it in the back of the net. Eight now. Take him off now? Maybe. Here's the replay. Ali needs a sponsor. Outside the box finish. Ain't nil them. And we're back underway. Two or three goals now from kickoff that Marshall have conceded. Oh, nice turn there. Turn into trouble. No other options on, really. So you keep hold of the ball. It's hard to keep hold of it. Good battling for number seven there. Poor pass though. Bennett. It's like literally got Holt got two extra men on the pitch. Snuffing out every attack. It's a throw on the far side towards the centre midfielder. Nice inch of play. 1-2. They break down the left hand side. Stonewall penalty. Let us have a look at the replay. I think he just clips him. Yeah, clips the back leg. Easy decision for the referee. He was quite far away. Scott Bungo with the pen. Back of the net. Sponsored by Eyecatcher, Pom Pom London, and JWC Fitness Specialists. Hint of Bruno Fernandes run up there. Love it. And that makes it 9 0. 58 minutes in, half an hour to go. I'll definitely say we're probably going double figures. Love the fact that the coach of them whole are demanding more. Love it. Holt in possession. Nothing come from that. It's corner ball. Header. It's cleared. Not convincingly. He's pulled it back round. Oh, he's through the back of him there. He's gone down. That's a penalty. Let's have a look at the replay. Just there. That's where he goes down. Is it Ali? Ali to take this one. This could be the second hat trick. No mistake from Ali there. Backer than that. Cool as a cucumber. I'm keeping it in the right way though. Losing County, that's 10. We're in the double figures. Still got about half an hour. Probably with the reps added on, we've got another 45 minutes. Not a good day for Stamets to Marshall. Not sure how the results have gone since. Shaftesbury reserves have gone. Sam United's first team's gone. Football is quite a fragile sport, football at times, isn't it? Behind the scenes, clubs are right in the balance. When it's good, it's good, but when it's bad, it's bad. Stimmons so Marshall look like they've got all the stuff around them, those signboards, youth teams. Grounds in the back of that Scott Bunga is sponsored by Eye Catcher, Pom Pom London, and JWC Fitness Specialist. 68 minutes, 11 now. Got all the right infrastructure. Just need to get the right personnel in. 
and a bit of time to gel, really. Do you feel bad if you played from before and then you see a club in this bad of a state? Cup finals, won the league of them, and then you bugger off somewhere else. Don't know. Strange one, isn't it? Not much loyalty in non league football. Hear it said all the time. Nice ball. That is an outstanding assist. Scott Bungay, definitely more than a hat trick. Now, sponsored by iCatcher, Pom Pom, London, and JWC Fitness is 12 0. These goals are just coming from kickoff now. It's getting embarrassing. I'd go seven at the back, shut up shot, play for some pride, man each, get stuck in. I'd probably look to get sent off if I was playing for sure, step to Marshall at this point. That's just me personally, I'm not recommending it. Don't bother ringing the FA, reporting, because I ain't even got a fan number anyway. They've got no jurisdiction over me. Oh, he's done him. Shouts for handball, played at the whistle. Ali with another goal. 70 minutes in, it's 13 now. It's eight goals for seven or eight for Ali now. Was it handball? Definitely handball. Got to play to the whistle though, the ref on the blower. That would have been the fourth penalty. Thirteen nil to Hulk. Come on, start. Is somebody taking the piss down there? Love the support. Absolutely love it. It's gone out for a throw. We're going to stick with it. Steal from that kick off again. Hulk want more. Come on, stir. Keep your heads, 13 nil down. It's a nice switch over. It's free. It's Sam Bennett, nice cut back, and he's put it pretty keep his legs. 14 now. Sponsored by Coastal. I think it's Chiropody or something like that. I said carpentry and plumbing before. So, yeah, I'll leave a link in the description. Thanks for sponsoring, Sam. There's your return. Nice cheeky goal through the legs there. I think that sums up Stemmets the Marshall day to day. Sam Bennett on the score sheet, and he's 16. Love it. Oh, coming forward again. They want more. I didn't know they want it. It's just where the game's being played, isn't it? Stunner to Marshall. I can't string a pass together. Intercepted off in there. Let the keeper have a touch, please. Good touch from the keeper there. Some sort of half high presser. Threaded that through the eye of a needle. Kevin De Bruyne would be proud of that one. Squared it. Scott Bungay in the back of the net. 74 minutes. 15 nil. And no, this isn't rugby. With that tackle for the first penalty, it might as well have been rugby though. That was a shocker, that was. I'll make a short out of that. Another goal from kickoff conceded. I think they conceded about seven from kickoff. Zero resistance or defence, basically. Race. Race. Someone's trying to get hold of him, mate. Is that race? Free kick. Can it be another one? Oh. Keeper spilled it. Snap man again, Ali. 
That's his eighth for the night. It's 86 minutes. Please, referee, blow on the 90s. Let's have a look at the replay. Plenty of signboards up. Love to see that. 16 now. High score in Game on Academy TV? I believe so. Another masterclass from Holt. I'll tell you what, they know how to turn teams over. I'll leave a link in the description for the ham rec game. They were DPL champions pre season, turned them over 11 now. Crossed in. Nearly another one. Oh, he's on a run. He's going to get a... Con oh, referee was about to go and score. I bet they adjust the size of the scoreboard and everything. Apologies, Stem, Mr. Marshall. Got to show you the games. Hope everything improves soon. Thanks for watching Academy TV. Don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button. See you next time.